Yeah, um, no idea what this game entails, but this is called Hot Dog Stand The Works. Let's have a look. Oh, it looks awful already. Sunburst Communications. Okay. Hot Dogs. Oh, we get a little... Oh, it's like these, um... Like the Wendy's training videos. Okay. That's, that's roping me in. Sign in, please. All right. You know who I am. Uh, select the level beginner. No random events guided by flashing objects. Some random events. Many random events. Uh, let's just go normal for now. Why? Welcome to the Oh, it wasn't far stand. off. The works. We gotta turn this in up a little bit though. The mustard, you have to be prepared for each event in the arena and stay informed so you'll be top dog. Before each event, get off to a good start by going to the desk to check your to-do list and your calendar. Then tune into the TV for the day's weather and any special news reports. Check the bulletin board to find out how many people the arena can hold for different events. Read announcements from the arena management and see your inventory. Stock up on supplies for the stand by ordering from your supplier folder located in the file cabinet. Enter the quantities you want on the order form and pay by check. Set your prices on the today's special sign. Huh. Use your checkbook and franchise report on the computer to keep track of your costs and profits. When you are ready for business, so... go to the hot dog stand. If you manage your office well, sales will sizzle when you open this stand, so and your profits legit... for this season yeah. will be so this is just tasty. To for more delicious, information on running this stand, read the binder on your desk, look at the books in your bookcase, or go to the help menu. Huh, okay. So you've got to make $800. Um, run your whole operation, pricing. Um, yeah, okay. No announcements. Baseball, concert, football, soccer. That's the numbers. Attendance increases at an event when arena management advertises. Be Franks, turkey franks, hot dog buns, cans of cola, bags of chips, courtesy kits. Okay. Um. Yeah, let's let's run the operation. Computer, write checks, fill out the franchise report, or relax with a puzzle. Check here to see what you've already done, what you still need to do. Let's have a look. Check calendar and TV weather report. Check wholesale prices of each supplier. Order supplies. Write checks to each supplier. Set prices on event sign. Check inventory. Open hot dog stand. Okay. Um, oh, yeah, we got baseball on Saturday at 4. Concert at 7 p.m. Football 6 p.m. Sell that dog. Okay. Um, oh, yeah, you can check the TV. Binder left by the previous owner. Tips and. Okay. Hi, congratulations on taking over the hot dog stand. I ran the stand for many years before retiring and thought I'd leave you some advice based on what I've learned. I'm sure you'll do a great job. Frank. Of course, his name's Frank. Tips for stocking the stand. The suppliers tend to change the prices on wholesale units for different events and it pays to shop around because one supplier may offer you a better price than another one. If you can get a good price early in the season on items that won't spoil, like courtesy kits, chips, and cola... Stock up on them early so you won't get stuck paying more if the suppliers raise their prices as the season goes on. Don't overstock on items that can go bad like hot dog buns or you'll end up with food you can't sell. When you buy hot dogs and buns, make sure to buy equal amounts of each. People won't buy a hot dog without a bun or a bun without a hot dog. So if you run out of one or the other, you are stuck. Be Franks are a personal favourite, but people who are trying to eat healthy meals are also asking for turkey franks these days. Not that it's much healthier, but anyway... It's a good idea to stock both kinds. However, I've noticed that the old beef dog is a favourite at football games. And the old turkey dog really hits the spot at soccer games. Uh, another thing i found is people expect to get a courtesy kit free along with their hot dogs. And they get pretty mad if there aren't any. It's just like any fast food restaurant. You never get charged. You never get to charge directly for plastic utensils, napkins or stuff to put on the hot dogs. But our customers demand them. I've always gotten back what I paid for the courtesy kits for increased sales on hot dogs. When I ran out of courtesy kits, my sales took a nosedive. One of the crazy things I've told Ms. Frank, she says it's not true, but take it from me, is that the price I always have to pay for chips always seems to increase at the end of a season. You can count your francs on it. On really hot days, people get very thirsty. Sometimes our customers drink as many as three cans during the event. So make sure you have plenty of cola when the temperature is up. Over the past year, some of their suppliers have been real dogs. Old Bun 2-3 was great prices, has great prices, but is unreliable. 
Sometimes he delivers and sometimes he doesn't. I found over the years it's a bit a little better to pay a little more for something and be sure the guy delivers. Advertising. Now, I've learned a thing or two about advertising over the years. Almost any kind helps. I just loved it when the arena management did something special. Or even if I did something as simple as decorating my sign, everything almost always helped. One of the things I forgot to do was one time was put up a list of my prices. People got really mad when the prices weren't listed and I had to give my, away my dogs for free. Attendance and pricing are really tough things to figure out. I've tried to look for trends. I finally came to the conclusion that the book How to Run with the Big Dogs has got this one figured out. I studied and analyzed all of the data from there and it really seems to work, so don't forget to check it out. Okay. Um, so yeah, we've got to check the news right on the calendar. And now oh, it's this time for the weather horrible. with Frank the Weather Wiener. <laughs> we have light rain falling yeah. outside, so bring your umbrella and your booties if you go out to the stadium for the big event. All right, light rain. Oh, we get the little reflection of the office. That's cool. Um, no, that's all we had there. So what's next? Check wholesale prices on each supplier. Oh, it's even showing us the ropes, basically. Um, okay, Blue Farms, One Two Three, Wally's Wiener World. Ah, oh, it's old ones. Okay. Um, 376. Okay, so I guess you go by who's got the cheapest prices and then get your quantities and stuff. How much? Are, okay, we got $500 on us. Um, I guess we purchase from each different supplier. Work out. I don't know how much we, we're going to have food wise. They said do the. Um, Who's got the cheapest courtesy kits? Right, we'll go Wally's Wiener World. We'll go, uh, let's say 10 by, yeah, because all this stuff's non-perishable. So we'll stock up on chips, cola, and courtesy kits. Uh, 50 bags of chips. Oh, no, that's actually quite pricey. All right. Um, so maybe five courtesy kits to start, 10 chips, $10. Yeah, that's not going to leave us much for hot dogs, though, is it? Um, go five for that. Um, estimator. Oh, hang on. Add up totals. Um, specifically designed to help you estimate the price of various amounts of supplies. You fill in two values, and the th tool will calculate the third for you. Oh, okay. So we can just, it's just a calculator. Yeah, righto. Checkbook. Um, okay, so we only got. Uh, actually, maybe go back. We'll go five. For that one. Checkbook. Send. Um, so, and then we uh, order elsewhere. What was it? Three. Well, Wally's Wien World seems to be the cheapest, doesn't it? Um, so we'll probably go... What's left? 200? Ah, oh, no, we'll go... Hang on. Um, 20... Uh, yeah, I don't know how many hot dogs we're supposed to supply, but we obviously have to have twice as many buns as we have hot dogs. So 20, 10, 10. Um, maybe... Because these are meant to go off as well, aren't they? Um, we'll make that 30. Oh, we're just shy. Um, hang on, make that 29. So we're just under budget. Okay. Cool. All right. So we've ordered everything. Set prices on event sign. Check inventory. Open hot dog stand. Okay. Um. So we'll do the specials. What do we want for hot dogs? So let's make it about seven for hot dogs. Seven for turkey dogs. Um. I uh, should have worked out what prices were for chips. Let's say two. Maybe two for cola. And do we have a way to check inventory? Or are we just going to the stand? Hang on. Okay, no, that was uh, full of books with useful information. Hot dog jokes. Oh, God, there's got to be some terrible hot dog jokes in here, surely. What do you call a frankfurter with, that visits the North Pole? A chili dog. Why did the detective ask the hot dog so many questions? He wanted to grill him. Why did Frank the hot dog win the race? Frank could run further. What did the sitter say to the naughty hot dog? 
I've never seen a brat worse than you. All right, no, that was pretty good. That was pretty good. How does a wiener handle life with relish? How does Granny Hot Dog wear her hair in the barn? What is the beginning of Stephen Foster's famous hot dog ballad? Way down upon the Salami River. Oh god, even I'm too old for that one. Oh, we'll save some jokes for later. How to run with the big dogs in an event. Complete guide to sporting and cultural events. So this just gives us oh, yeah, info about the... Oh god, there's just full info on how football works. You should probably read up on this one, but anyway. Um, what else we have for the... Okay, so we got... Yep. Ordered supplies. Price has been sent. Oh, we can print out the journals. Okay. Um, how do we check the inventory? Oh, yeah. Check current inventory. Yeah. 180 francs, 182 francs, turkey francs. So, yeah, someone's going to be like two buns short. Cans, color bags, ships, courtesy kits. All right. Let's. Um, oh, don't. No, we did our prices. What was the other thing we had to do? Check to do list. Yeah, just go to the sand. All right. Um, let's see how much item you have in stock. What else we got? Yeah, that's just inventory. Watch out for any signs that might break down. Oh, do we, so we're going to have to actually control this? Okay. Let's open the stand. Are we meant to be doing anything? Oh. Oh, we just did everything. Okay. Attendance at the ba 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 uh, attendance at the baseball game is 10,406. Weather turned to be fair and clear. Uh, we sold no hot dogs, no turkey dogs, 19 colors, 21 chips. Leftover dogs and bums will spoil before the next event. Bank balance is now $80. Gold is $800. Um, okay. We, I guess we set the price too high for hot dogs. And we just blew all the money just for buying extra stuff, didn't we? Shit. Okay. <laughs> that was kind of disastrous. Yeah, so case in point. No buns, no dogs, no francs. Okay. Um, probably should check the prices a little better. Oh, we got the franchise report. Yep. Didn't sell. Uh, oh, there's a little... Oh, it's a fucking slidey block puzzle. No, fuck that off. Get rid of that. Uh, this next event is a concert. Same again, check the TV. And now it's time for the weather with Frank the Weather Wizard. I was kind of hoping for some uh, interactivity. What it's going to be. With temperatures up in the high 80s, it's going to be a real roaster. It'll be clear and sunny all day with warm temperatures. Perfect day to head to the park or the stadium for a ball game. Yeah, okay. Um, oop. Oh. Right. So. Yeah, that just seemed like $7 seemed reasonable for a hot dog. And, oh, well, it doesn't, though. Yeah. That's that's a bit more of an issue. Let's go maybe five, five, and ten, and just set the prices a little bit lower because that's really all I can afford this time around. Um, yep, send that off. We did not make much on that first event. Um, set prices. So let's say two. Let's just set it that and see if we actually sell anything. Maybe put cola up a little bit. Because it's supposed to be a hot day and everyone's drinking. Um, inventory seems okay. What else were we doing? Yeah, we set prices. Um, and that was it. All right. Open the stand. Yeah, I guess it's going a little too fast actually to do gameplay, isn't it? Okay, um, attendance was 12,397, weather turned out to be hot and sunny, uh, we sold 60 hot dogs, two colas, and 25 chips. Yeah, okay, okay. Um, so we made money, we didn't make money back, but, um, got some. <laughs> that June, though, that June's pretty good. Um, okay. So same again, I suppose, check the weather. And now it's time for the weather with Frank the Weather Wiener. We have light rain falling outside, so bring your umbrella and your booties if you go out to the stadium for the big event. Actually sounds a little bit like Frank Zappa, that guy. Hell. 
All right. No, we just checked the. Oh, we gotta check the calendar. The soccer at four p.m. Um. Yep. Check prices. No, we did that. We did that one. Um. Oh yeah. Supplier. Um. So can we go? Little sheep. I can hear the cat snoring even through my headphones. Bloody hell. Um. Yeah. So two twenty one. Let's go. Maybe not so much. Maybe no. We'll yeah. We'll set the prices even cheaper this time around. Um. So let's go. What do we want? Say twenty buns, ten dogs, ten francs. Yeah, ten lots of francs. That seems to be the way to go. Send off for that. Back up. Um. Yep. Set the prices on the pricing sheet. We go. Fitty. Maybe maybe one and maybe Yeah, go one fitty on the collar just to see if we sell a little better this time around. Check inventory, hot dogs, sake dogs, buns, collars, chips, cursey kits. Cool. Man, I'm liking the music though. No, 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 it's just just meant to be teaching me a like basic business stuff. Works. Okay, that was a little better. There we go. So not as many yeah. Plus people in America like soccer obviously. Light rain. Plenty of turkey dogs. Yeah. Bit of cola, bit of chips. 387. We're not selling that as much um Yeah, we're we're kind of overbuying on the um on the hot dogs, don't we? Yeah, maybe set the price lower this time. All right. Um, weather. And now it's time for the weather with Frank the Weather Wiener. Cold and foggy today. It is so cold <laughs> that you can freeze your buns off. Beans. You can see by this afternoon we're going to get hit with the worst oh, storm it's ever he's to a hit chilly the region. Dog. Yeah, if I you don't it. have to go anywhere, listen to your pal Frankie. Stay home. Oh, okay. So that might actually affect attendance this time. Yep, football, 6 p.m. Uh, might be a big crowd, though. Also, prices on the supplier. Uh, who's giving us best prices, though? Because we're right for collar and shit from the looks of that. Um, so let's go. Yeah, no, we'll go. Hang on, hang on. Um, 10, 5, 5. That seems a little less, though. No, nah, let's go 20, 10, 10. Yep, buy that. And then we want to set prices. Yeah, go. Maybe just one for everything. And maybe bump up prices on something that sells a little better. Uh, yep, 120, 120, 240, 68. Alright. There we went this side. Yeah, because we're not getting. Uh, customer feedback or anything like that on these are we um yeah okay so the attendance was lower because of the weather okay we sold out on hot dogs and turkey dogs yep um 68 colors 70 chips yeah okay well that's good we're, we're getting cleaned out on that lease and we are over 800 okay now try again to earn even more mm. no nah, i'm good May 821 through the four events goal was 800. Oh, okay. And that was, so I guess it changes. Like that's the, you just try to earn as much as you can in the little events and then do something else. Maybe we'll, we'll do a new game. We'll go random events, see what actually plays up. Um, okay. So same again. Um, check the weather. And now it's time for the weather with Frank the Weather Wiener. Where the we know, though. If you were planning on going to the big game at the stadium today, why, you're in luck! Yeah, the sky will be clear today with temperatures in the high 50s. So let's get out to that parking lot and just, do some tailgating. Yeah, you're kind of trying to do basic hey, bring the grills. I want to see some hamburgers sizzle. <laughs> or just teaching the kids the basics of that. And th just the teeth on the dog, though. That's, it's freaking me out. Um, so what did they say? Football? No, hang on. 
Sometimes the reliability of a supplier is more important than wholesale price. Yeah, no, that's fair. Yeah, it's they got to be able to deliver, I suppose. All right, so we got soccer on Wednesday. Um, go back to that bulletin board though. So soccer you usually rope in about five thousand people. Um, yeah, okay. We'll check the suppliers. Hang on. Let's see if we can get a better. All right, so bun two three is definitely good for buns. Let's go. Uh, I'm trying to do the math. Twenty dozen. Oh, I guess that's why the calculator comes in handy. So like twenty times twelve is two forty. Okay, so we should probably be buying more and just selling at a lower price to just sell out on stock, maybe. Um. What do, we, what do we want? What, 5,000? Um, yeah, because there's no guarantee they're going to want... Um, everyone's going to want a hot dog. But that's sort of what we're looking at for... Right, hang on. 5,000 divide 12. No, hang on. Um, 5,000 divide 12 would be 416. So what, we spy... Ah, huh, okay. We'd have to buy 400 buns? No, four... Oh, God. <laughs> you get, the stupid games get me to do maths on a Sunday again. All right, let's go 30. Um, Yeah, we'll just do the buns for the... Hang on, who's, who's got the better... Yeah, they're cheapest on buns. Okay, so we can tee up eat different things from each supplier from the looks of that. Um, so what's cheapest? Oh, okay. So hot dogs are still cheap there. We'll go that one. Uh, who's got cheapest turkey dogs? Ah, oh, these guys. 15 and 9, 28. Probably 10 for these. And then we don't really need all that much in the way. Uh, let me go five chips. We still got to, we got to, still got to get under 500, don't we? Um, and then maybe three, no, four courtesy kits. Um, yeah, all right. Oh, we're actually at a loss. Don't have enough money in your account to send this check. So we got to change this one. Um, yeah, maybe knock it down. 25, 10, 10. Do that. Send that. Okay, so we got our supplies. No, we and now okay. it's time for the weather. Yeah, had enough of that weather report. Okay, hot dog buns, cola chips, courtesy kits. Maybe shouldn't have gone overboard on courtesy kits, but anyway. Um, what else was on the checklist? Oh, set the prices. Yeah. Okay, set prices. And just do one for everything. This seems to be the best way just to get the um, right market price, I guess. All right. We're, yeah, jamming out on making that money, aren't we? Um, 6,000 attendance for the soccer. Sold out on, yeah, hot dogs and turkey dogs. Well, that's good. Plenty of cola, plenty of chips. We made 500 back. Okay, yeah. We had a little... Uh, we made a slight profit on that one. Okay. we got to make 1,300. Hot dogs cooking! concert for this one um so concert at four what was attendance for and now concerts? it's time for the weather with frank the weather wiener heavy rains are coming we're talking a soaker downpours like oh, you haven't seen in a long time it'll be accompanied by some frame. house rock and thunder and there's even a chance of electrifying lightning <laughs> okay so that's gonna put attendance down a little my bit, friends say. this is your old pal frank the weather wiener here signing off you wishing you Good weather. Certainly a toast of Dwina, though. All right. Um, so we'll go back. So attendance on a concert, 10,000. Jeez. Okay. Uh, underpricing can result in low profit. All right. Um, we'll go to the suppliers again. 
Um, yeah, no, there's just there's still lower prices for um, shit overall. So yeah, this time we don't worry about. We got plenty of maybe another thing at cola. Hang on, who's got cheap cola? Um, maybe a, a five a colas, and then go. 30, 15, 15. We should be able to pay. Yeah, pay both of these. Send off the checks. Um, what else do we want to do? Ah, oh, set prices. Um, maybe go. Uh, let's go. One fifty. Put the prices up a little bit. Um. Yeah, maybe a little less. Maybe one twenty-five for cola. That might work. Then, yep. Check inventory. Go to the hot dog stand. Okay. Let's open up. Oh, so that's the random events. So something potentially you play up. Oh, okay. Um, thunderstorms, 8,000 at the concert. Sold. Yep, left out it. Okay, 6.15 or at 9.28. Alright, no, we're actually doing all right. Not as big on that. Okay, no, that's sort of interesting. Like, yeah, from a managerial sort of point of view, it's cool to figure out, um, yeah, you know, just basic economy and stuff. Yeah, there we go. Poor weather means smaller crowds. Um, so we need more chips this time around. Uh, check that one. And now it's time for the weather with Frank the Weather Wiener. Cold Love and it. foggy today. It is so cold that you can yeah, freeze your bums off. Attendance. You can see by this afternoon yeah, we're going like to get hit with the worst storm ever to hit the region. If you don't have to go anywhere, listen to your walls. pal Frankie. Stay home. Okay. Um, yep, so lower attendance. Um... I didn't even check to see what the um, thing was. Football this time. Um, usually get a fair bit of football though. Oh, we did. yeah, no, no, it's cold. Um, hang on. So football's about six thousand. Um, now we want to check pliers. Um, what do we reckon maybe? Um, twenty ten ten. And then, who's got the best price on cola? Uh, these guys from looks of things. All right, fifteen things at cola. Um, yeah, all right. So we're definitely not going over our balance. We we're having a little bit of profit each time. That's good. Um, oh yeah, set the prices again. Um, no, that seemed to work well last time. Um, yeah, no, I'm happy with that. That's, that seems to be fine. Oh, hang on. We didn't get chips though. Um, no, no. oh, we've, have we goofed it? Yeah, no, go back to the office. We've got to buy chips. We've got to get chips. Um, you want to, yeah, no, I bought cola and not chips. Yeah. That's, um, not what we want. Oh, no, that's pricey for chips though. Um, yeah. All right. Uh, that'll, that'll work. Buy some chips. Um, maybe put the price up on chips. There's the demand for it. Um, 120. Um, 25. That'll do. All right. Yeah. Plain chips. Let's see how we go this side. Yeah, nothing seems to be, I guess the refrigerator and the um, thing I can play up. Uh, attendance was 4,000. Oh, no, we didn't sell that much this time, did we? Yeah, okay. Baseball this time. Yeah, it's legit like that grill skills song in the um, the Wendy's training video, isn't it? Um, so what did we say baseball was for attendance? 8,000. Depending on the weather. The weather. And now it's time for the weather with Frank the Weather Wiener. If you were planning on going to the big game at the stadium today, right. why yep. you're in luck. Yeah, the Good sky will be clear today with temperatures in the high. 
Okay, beautiful. Um, definitely need, definitely need hot dogs. Uh, oh, prices are going up on um, buns though. Probably go. Uh, the attendance is going to be higher, so we'll go twenty ten ten. Hot dogs. Um, yeah, buy that. And how are we doing on? Um, oh, we got to get more courtesy kits. Okay. That's maybe why we lost profits last time, because we ran out of kits. Because everyone wants their little fucking napkins and shit. Um, and, oh, God, that is pricey, though. You have five on that. All right. Um, check inventory. Yeah, we really don't have much in the way of um, hot dogs, do we? All right. Probably something I forgot to do with all this one. Seems like we only get like four events to have a crack at. And yeah, don't seem to have had mistakes in terms of um, it, uh, random events and stuff. Um, yep, sold out on hot dogs and turkey dogs, plenty of coal, plenty of chips. Yeah, okay. That's probably what we're doing right. We're actually under stocking for hot dogs. We'd probably sell more if we got more, but potentially, yeah, you know. We don't want any to spoil. Um, all right, so we got one more event to make about three hundred bucks. Okay. Um, oh, plenty of color and chips, so that's good. Um, what was the event? Baseball. Eight thousand for baseball. And now it's time for entertainment news with oh, we got some entertainment news. Oh. Hello. Hello. This is Porky Chops. We're gonna be leaving on tour soon, and we'd like to play one more gig locally before we go. I was wondering if you'd be interested in hiring the band to play outside your wiener stand during the big game this week at the stadium. Yeah, I suppose we could. Um, oh, we can't respond to that? Did we just, we didn't just hang up on them? If you'd like to make a call, please hang up. Um, I guess we And now it's time for entertainment news with Lee Darwin. I don't know if we're able to hire him or not. Porky Chops and the Vienna Sausage Choir have scored a hit with their newest single, Baked Bean Blues. Baked Bean Blues. Porky and the band are perfectly getting ready to hit the road Very next well. month on their first national Very tour. Um, we wish them pop. good luck and much success. Yeah, okay. And now it's time for the weather with Frank the Weather Wiener. We have light rain falling outside. Right, so so bring your umbrella and your booties if you go out to the stadium for the big event. I think we should be right. We got plenty of chips and shit. Um, we can probably go all out on um, on buns and stuff. So let's go 30, um, 15, 15. Book, send that. Oh, we can hire. Oh, we just spent $200 to hire the band. They were just on the checkbook. Okay. We should be right for, um, yeah, plenty of stuff there. Um, do we want to bump up prices? Oh, I'm going to bump it up. Let's go. No, maybe 175. Um, not 175. 175. And chips and cola can stay the same. That'll work. Um, we did a checklist. Oh, we didn't check the calendar. Okay, hang on. Check that. Yep, baseball. Uh, go to the stand. Hi, I'm Porky. <laughs> this is my band. We're ready to play. We'll just set up right outside your wiener stand. Alright, one way to rope in the customs. Alright, how do we do this time? Holy shit, there we go. 9,000, light rain. Hide band. Uh, kind of undersold on hot dogs and turkey dogs, but yeah, all right. No, we we made our goal though. We could probably just sit down on our um laurels for this one, make the goal. Um, just hang on. Yeah, ten, five, five. That'll do. That can be our thing. Maybe put prices back down a little bit. Um, one. 50, 150, and yeah, and just sell out on the rest of the stock. Uh, check the weather though. And now it's time for the weather with Frank the Weather Wiener. 
We have light rain falling outside, so bring your umbrella and your booties okay. if you go out to the stadium for the big event. Okay. Um, what was the what was the actual event? No, football. So what are we expecting for that? Probably about yeah, eight thousand for baseball. Um, what else do we have to do? We set prices. Yeah, just open the stand. All right, let's do that. I want to watch the commitments again. This is probably the best example of that sort of music for um, Joe Cocker or something like that. Oh, blitzed it. 7,000 attending. Oh, we got some competition though. There were, there was a new vendor. Okay. Yep, sold out on hot dogs and take dogs. Yeah, beautiful. Let me split it again. Way cool! Oh, we got to click through. Oh, we... Yeah, okay. No, we, we did it. All right. No, that was that was a fun little aside. That was just something different. Way to teach the kids, you know, basic economics. But no, no that was fun. I'm watching Death Sandals video, by the way. That's that's who the, the person is. So if you want to watch a full playthrough, Death Death Sandals. 